21st Century Noir, A Criminal Omission by Ed Brubaker and Sean Phillips. The Lover. I was probably in love with Nellie before I met her. Met her in person, I mean. We'd been talking on the net for weeks by that time. I'd be at work, bored out of my mind, and just start IMing her, and she'd ping me right back, laughing at whatever joke I made, like she knew me. Long before I even saw a picture of her, I was pretty sure she was the one. But when she brought me back to her hotel room, when she squeezed me up inside in the softest place in the world, I knew for sure, yeah, I was in love. And I knew I'd do, stop laughing, Michelle. <laughs> and I knew I'd do anything to make it last, just to stay like this forever. Almost can't believe it. I mean, you go your whole life waiting for just one person to really see you, you know? I know, yeah. But it's comp. Oh. But it's complicated, David. What? What do you mean? Oh come on! I'm not exactly young. We met anonymously. I mean, did you really think there'd be no complications? And I swear to God, I didn't even notice her wedding ring until right then. <laughs> the wife. Part of me knows before I even say a word that David will do it. The way he looks at me, the passion in his hands and his eyes. The way his cock stands at attention just at the sight of me. But I've gone through it so many times in my head, so I just say it all. He hits you? On good days. On the good days, yeah. But, I, I'm sorry, I tell him about the time Bart tied me to the bed for two days to punish me. About how my own husband forced himself on me over and over again. How he videotaped me sucking him off and threatened to put it on YouTube. How I'm basically a prisoner in my own home. And I always thought I was so strong, you know, that I'd never be like my mom was. But it turns out I don't know anything. That I'm just some scared little girl. Jesus. Jesus fucking Christ. I don't even have to mention that all the money is in Bart's name. I'm gonna fucking kill him. I'm gonna bash his fucking brains in with a fucking hammer. Wait, calm down, David. Please. We have to be smart about this. The husband. You gotta love the internet, don't you? <laughs> Whatever gets you off, you can find it there. Or put it there and let other people get off on what gets you off. And I'll freely admit, I'm more twisted than most people are. But everyone's twisted in their own way. I mean, aren't they? Hello? Is someone there? Yeah! The kid gives it a try, but he's got nothing. Crack! But then I knew he was coming, so I had the advantage. See, me and Nellie, we're twisted together. Better <laughs> gag him, hon. He's a screamer. She likes to watch their eyes as they fuck her, these kids, knowing they're in love with her, with their lies. I like to watch from the hotel room closet, getting off while they plan my murder. The best, though, is making them watch us, watching their hearts break, once they realize what's coming next. I tell you, people are just so fucking pathetic. The end. <laughs>